Uh, it sure is nice looking at the full and complete Beswick Chekhov lift stand. Leon. Castlevania. 109. Oh, oh god, no. It's new DLC time. Vampire Survivors. Castlevania. Oh, to Castlevania. The new update. Woohoo. Let's get messing around with Leon Belmont. I just did a quick run through the stage to grab him with Mask of the Red Death. He receives a hidden Zvarog statue at level 5. Gets a bonus to most stats when a vampire killer is equipped. And finds special pickups. And Ode to Castlevania. As myriad humans from all over the world join their vespers in unison, the forces of chaos resonate and grant to them their dark wish. King of Terror raises again and with him is Demon Castle, Castlevania. Turn events off, hurry off, inverse off, Arcana's limit break on, start Leon's theme, Vampire Survivors. And let's go with the beginning. Also, God, there's so many weapons. So, so many new weapons. Like, it's crazy amount of new weapons. Absolutely insane. Wow, so many. Yeah, so this is actually my second attempt at the recording because I didn't have curse on and I forgot to unseal things. So, uh, that's annoying, but Vampire Survivors Beswick is starting all over again. Hey, look. Without giving curse actually increases the amount of things that show up. Well, cross makes sense for some Belmonton. Peter. Okay, down in the left there was the map in that forest. And that skull is a boss, so let's go over there. Armor. Well, alchemy whip, base the area up. Damage up by five. It's nice to be able to kill things. Probably shouldn't have gotten fire. Hey, pot roast. I don't know whether that's... Oh, can I go in this building? I didn't check last time. Yeah, I can. Neat. Oh, it's a teleporter from Symphony of the Night. Oh, cool. Also, scroll out of the map. Good God, it is huge. Like, it's insane how big this is. Oh, huh, what's that? A shield? A binder? Uh, I don't think I'll need that. Lightning ring. That is kind of Castlevania y because of the gun thing from Symphony of Night. All right, let's get down to this boss over here. Man, it feels so much better. All right, hidden path. I did not have any trouble finding this. Ooh, homing miss is a good idea too. Missiles are very good against the forces of darkness. War on 1999. Map was right over here. Boss. Well, it wasn't much of a challenge either. But hey, with curse, it could put up something of a fight. I even had charm on, and yet there were still basically no enemies. Uh, do I want stone mask? Nah. Level. F Wait, what was that? That hidden Svarag stone. I don't know what that does. Base area up twenty percent again. Base damage up five again. It's gonna do a lot of damage. Oh, why am I going down? I'd want to go up. Man, Holy Miss has been so improved. Kind of crazy, actually, how much better it is now than what it was for poor Stanley on release. I don't exactly need money, and Leon, well, just opening it with the coffin didn't require any cash. Cash money. It's, man, there's basically no enemies up here either way. This is where I realized I didn't have curse on because there was nothing spawn in, but even with it on, there's not much. Oh, this guy's quite Oh, I can go in this one too. Is it another teleporter? No. Hmm, interesting. Might be a secret there later. Hey, it's floor chicken, not floor pot roast. I definitely want to get some crown action. The Tirajisu over there is right where Leon's coffin was, so... 
Decorative art. Nice decorative art. Also, what seems to be up above me might be Dracula's room. He's in here. Stage looks so huge, you might actually want wings. Okay, with homing miss and the whip actually being upgraded, you shouldn't stand much of a chance, Behemoth. I don't know whether this is the next wave or what. I was just in a bad spot. Yorix, one of the funniest Castlevania enemies. A chest, an evolution chest, and this weird thing that's either a weapon or a passive, but... Skull. Hmm. Don't know how difficult it's going to get, but I do have a full loadout. Alright, beginning effects, the alchemy. Yeah, let's uh, beef up the enemy count. Next level, he's damage up by 10 again. Probably the tier Jisoo, because it's right next to Leon's coffin to get the uh, whip evolved into who knows what. Alright, so try to get crown, attract orb, empty tome. That'll get me a lot. Hmm. Bonus box is also an option. Do you want to get the passives up ASAP? Well, that's just always a good pick. No downsides to picking up a weapon pickup. Shouldn't show up again. In fact, I needed that. Get them multi-stage missile. This box would give me ash as a muscle too. A lot of chickens spawning. Maybe that's the Belmont voodoo. Hey, small clover. Lucky. Armor. Jisoo's on the map. Hmm. No. There's empty tomb. Yeah, now we're whipping. Alright, two more. Weapon does not take it up. Whipping good. Nothing like a Belmont whipping to whip it good. Definitely need a tractor. You have, like, no magnet range. Feels weird. Coming in a bit more fiercely. Vacuum would not be out of bounds. Eh, one more duplicator isn't bad. Don't want to spend all my rerolls. Wait, I should get this chest now since I'll be on the move. Ooh. Oh, it's guaranteed. It's going to be guaranteed, isn't it? Everything we want. Hey, it's Medusa. Wow, she looks almost exactly like her Symphony of the Night variant. And hey, the plants trap you in too. Well, Empty Tome always great. Yeah, just like Mad Forest. Yeah, they're putting up a bit more of a fight. Oh, so nice to see so many Yorks. They're such a fun enemy. Too bad they basically never exist. That's like the occasional joke, but now they can do what they need to. Be fun. There's a track orb. More level up, better. And try and get crown. As many levels as I can. This one isn't open. Huh? What was that noise? Over one sixth of the way through. Don't want to spend too many level ups. Wait, didn't that show up uh, with uh, Gemini? So it might be a weapon. I'm not going to take the risk. I have all the passives filled up just to make sure, because who knows. Really want a crown. I 
Uh, that's a bad idea, burning all my rerolls like this. But there we go. All right, are you a passive or a weapon? Rock Riot fires projectiles from a fixed location. That's a regular weapon, not a passive. And it's up there on the top right near the kill counter. Oh, it's changed. Oh, it changes depending on where I'm looking. Then it's like clear asteroids, except probably not crap. Or clear asteroids is great. Like clear debris, except not crap. All right, let's mosey on down to that tier Jisoo. That probably will evolve Vampire Kill. That's sort of how they do it. They sort of add which ones evolve to the map. Well, no, it was just Prism Lass. Foresty. It was just the, the wings for Prism Lass. I suppose the, everything for Polis Replica was on the map for a mar urgency meeting. Uh, what about Hides? Yes. Everything for their weapons was also on the map. And for a moon spell. Ooh. Can I do anything about that? Is that anything? So the Gemini probably makes it so that there's one on both sides for the spell. Maybe this is Charlotte's starting weapon? Charlotte, Jonathan, Charlotte, Jonathan. Pretty much in the way of level ups. AC area up by 20%, cooldown reduced by half a second, but I want a track door if I gotta level up quick. No early evolution chests here by default. Hey. Feels so weird not playing on hurry. I've done it for so long. I had that one bats video, but conversion guns was a while ago at this point. All right, grab that TRG Sue, and with that comes a sweet, sweet extra revive. Don't want to worry about the Metaglios. All right, let's break into Castlevania proper now. Rolling out the red carpet, eh? Drac. All right. Am I stuck here? Crazy. Oh, man, that's like the that's the PS1 background for Symphony of the Night, isn't it? A recreation. Nice. Oh, Symphony of the Night is such an amazing game. A lot of easy once you know what to do, but man, is it still fun. Sense of exploration and such. Inspired Dark Souls for you. One more projectile. Basically, constantly firing. Keep on whipping, Leon. Keep on whipping. Alright, should be another boss. Can I go up? Okay, yeah. Let's take down the one here first. Looks like a weapon over there. Hey, the symbol isn't different for the bosses. Ooh, an armor DO2. Hey, it's Giant Bat. Hi, Giant Bat. Hey, Axe Armors. Oh, good. That's going to be a huge vacuum. Armor DO, I can grab. What? Good stuff. Oh, please tell me I didn't just skip. What do you do? Stallion Gate. Allows heart refreshes to materialize and grants access to new part of Dracula's castle. Oh, whoa. Vampire Killer? Vampire Killer. Evolved Alchemy Whip. Every third activation fires additional projectiles. Intense sunlight. Destroys boss enemies. Fire is better. Fire, fire. Light the fire. Oh, I probably needed that to get to this section. Crown up. Ooh, yeah. That was a huge vacuum. Well, let's get lucky. I don't need to have a full tier Jisoo either. Ah, uh, the night door. Okay, let's get this Armadillo so I can get Torona's box. Are they permanently open? Bracer is also a possibility. Okay, that's a wall. So it's still huge. Come on, man. That's Ponkle for you. Oh, that's a heart refresh. Uh, so what does that even do for me?
Oh, where are you? I don't remember seeing you before in Castlevania. You are the evolution. Alright, Armadillo first, just in case... Uh... This is the room, right? Crap, how far away is it? Oh, secret painting. Hey, aw, it's Alucard. Can't go in the paintings. Okay, what do I want here? Oh, I can just pick these, whatever they do. But one of them's on the map. Um, Trona's... That, that's a risk. And what do I have? A lot of good stuff. I'll take the risk. Sure hope it doesn't bite me in the behind. Oh, no, I can just banish it at the top. What am I thinking? Empty tome. That's always empty tome. More Alucard picture. Is that Lisa? Oh, chest. And gold ring. Is this another door? No. It just kind of looks like it. It's like a shattered mirror, sort of. A lot of fire coming out. Oh, Arcana. Alright, I got Vampire Killer now, so... Oh, hey, it highlights what weapons you have to get the benefits of the Arcana now. That's great. Does it move them to the front of the line, too? Huh. Yeah, Fire Miss, yeah. That's really cool. That's a great addition. I have nothing. Oh, I have two of these, actually. Okay, yeah, both of those. Okay. Three bounces. That sounds like it could be good, because Heaven's Sword is still Heaven's Sword. Anything else I have? Another hand boosting up the main weapon. I'll take the risk for boosting up the main weapon. And the risk has not paid off. Oh, there it is. Slash. Enables critical hits for illicit weapons. Doubles overall critical hit damage. That will beef up Heaven Sword as well, so. Yeah, we're cooking with damage. 541. Wow, that does a ton. I don't even have spinach. Crown. Level up. Ooh. Page. Excellent. Another vacuum. Oh, the weapon's down here. Definitely want to fight the Atlantean, but... But what else? Oh, missile is really low. No multi-stage missile for a bit. That is... Some sort of... Scythe? Curved knife. Fires a spinning projectile at a random enemy. Huh? Who throws a knife? Grant's knives are straight-edged. Well, I guess you can't really have Grant with straight-edged knives considering straight knives. I didn't really check the full character roster. Ooh, you're coming on fast for some reason. I mean, you shouldn't survive too long. This whip does a ton of damage. Especially with Slash. Oh. Huh. Is there a candy box by default on the map? Do one more enemy. What would evolve the knife? Feels like Green Mask because of the whole pirate thing. Wow, why are you surviving so long? Curse really does give you a ton of survivability. You were just dying instantly during the... Six wave stuff without curse on you. Man, I'm hitting way harder than all four could, too. Doesn't count as a boss, it seems. Uh, curved knife. 
Woo. I don't think I want to risk more curse. I think I'm just going to head on over. Rock Riot. This area is even bigger. Huge now. Try grinding it out. Does it even evolve? What did it evolve with? Vacuums are starting to show up pretty consistently. That's nice. Hmm. I mean, its area increases. Maybe it evolves with a, a parm or something. Coin. Oh, a lucky coin over there. Or, huh. For some reason, it doesn't let you go down further any down any further. There are so many Orologians popping up because I went lucky. Castlevania. And this should unlock the next character in the chain. Oh, hey, look at that. Okay, so it's only like the bosses for the stage. The Atlanteans don't count for it. Oops. Well, I had two chests, so. Oh, well, I'll make it next level even faster. I'd almost be done by now if this was on hurry. But I have so much longer to go. We got some a lot of vampire killing action today. Castlevania. This one will obviously be uploaded as soon as I finish it because gotta hit that ASAP. -ing. But then the rest of them will be coming back to the regular time. The new post time of 1 p.m. EST or 1 a.m. EST. Because otherwise it was hitting right when I was streaming. It was kind of messing up the scores. Don't compete with yourself. That class, half a second longer, base damage up by five. Kind of boomerangy, I guess. Or crossy with the knives. Uh, kind of hard to see the curved knife. Hey, it's you guy, lesser demon. Okay, you count as a boss, too. Wow, well, I've basically evolved no weapons, huh? Or leveled up no weapons. Bone Tower Shooters. The original Bone Tower Shooters. But, well, I got Fire Trail, so not much you're going to do to stop me. That's a really good weapon, you know? Got strong clearance in the front and some safety in the back. Of course, with no move, you're going to lose some of that power. 41. Probably won't be able to evolve Rock Rye with what I have. Well, maybe the empty tome will count for all of the spellbooks. Is it maxed out? No, it's still one more. I think probably Green Mask for the knife. That feels right. I want to. I'd have preferred to save the rerolls for. All oh, right, I didn't check to like anything really. I just wanted to get straight into it. I don't know what's in the collection. I don't know what I need to unlock. There's three more projectiles. All right, let's see if you evolve with the empty tome. You do not. And the knife is level four, so that'll take a while. So just move on up. Be more efficient with time. All right, it might be one of the other things on the map. Let's move up and try and grab that Arge, Tarma, Parge. Oh, there's another. Oh, wait, maybe... That, wait, where am I going? I actually need to zoom in just to. Okay, so I have to go, wait, let me check this. Because that's the icon for the thing I got from the giant bat. So does this give me a shortcut or something? Oh, it allows me to teleport. Okay. 
So is that like a permanent upgrade just for the stage? Man, the stage is long. I probably should have grabbed wings. Ooh, it's the Kukri guys. Or no, the curved dagger? Dang it, the three brothers. One had a curved knife, one had da dagger blades, serrated swords, the other had a hammer. Hammer! Hey, Rosary. Uh, keep an eye out for chess or anything else showing up. I'm not actually going to be able to complete this. This stage is so big. Crazy. On the other side, I got to curve around. All right, who you at, boss? Hey, it's a giant Medusa head. The light of the sun will destroy you. Oh, whoa. Apparently did destroy you. Go up. Lightning ring up. Not guaranteed five chests. I just got lucky on the behemoth one. Urban knife. Oh, wait. I thought it was closer to where I was. Now right, let's mosey on over. Ba -ba -ba -bom. Next boss go. Oh, hey, it's the cleaning maids. Hey, it's Slogger and Garba, everyone's favorite first boss. Hi guys, how's it going? Absolutely pathetic as usual. How did I ever die to you, even when I was a dumb kid? This is frankly barely less than what they did in the game. Hey, Chester. Wow. I think I've only level up cross through these. Hmm, close to getting that. Max out the curved knife. I swear it'll probably be green mask 100% to evolve that knife. Gotta be... Yeah, just gotta test it ASAP. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, figured. That or one of the other things on the map. Rock does pretty decent damage. Vampire killer though, man, it hits so hard. Hey, marionette's neat. Right here's that spot, go up. My direct up clearance is pretty weak. Only 10 minutes more. I will have barely gone through this at all. Now, nah, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that at all. Hmm. Now I get the passive. Can I go in the paintings? That feels like it really should be a secret with the way it's arced. Arced? Painted? Set up? Yeah, set up works. Alright, you're definitely going to be in this room. And yeah, nice vacuum. Minotaur. Minotaur. Oh, I can just go up here. This is invulnerability time after getting damaged by 50 milliseconds. The hell? He doesn't have invincibility frames. What are you talking about? Well, I can get one more level. Just so I can get the Heaven Sword. Oh, of course. No, see, see, there are no invincibility frames. What is it he talking about? That's what makes enemies remotely dangerous. You get hit, you just take a ton of damage. Dang, the Aegis doesn't go towards it, unless it needs to be maxed out. 
seems unlikely considering the tier juice you didn't ma need to max out for vampire killer here. Whip it good, Belmont. Whip it good. Age turns a lot. It is a creature of chaos after all. On a chest, come to me. Nothing. Double bounce. Oh, I can see. Turns into one of those uh, three edge knives. Oh, there's another armadillo on the map. Mad Groove. I think that's the better idea. Oh man, the freeze did not help. Oh, we didn't grab the other things. Interesting. Very interesting. Oh, my NFT wore off. Did I even get an NFT? Yeah, I must have. I don't know what the heart refresh does. Maybe it's a heal. Oh, hey, I'm shooting off fireballs now. I don't remember seeing that earlier. And even with an NFT, they're taking a lot of damage. Incredible. Aegis. Okay, so I can't use Magroof to just grab everything. I do need to open up the castle more. Oh, there might have been something in there I missed that really does feel like it. Oh, and there was a path to the right, too. Wow, this is huge. Okay, definitely need to consider getting whip. Er, wings. Hey, it's a fountain of blood. Okay, there's Thunderloop. Boss, boss, be burned by the power of the sun. Thunderloop. Yeah. Oh, that looks suspicious. Nothing to it, though. Hey, a Castlevania portrait. Valocard. And Maria? Man, it's just gigantic beyond measure. Oh, hey, I can select my Arcana. Or look at my Arcana. What the hell? The hell was that? Oh, what the hell is... Oh my god, it turned 2D. I can jump? Oh my god. And do a flip. Oh my god, this is crazy. Dupli it's a doppelganger. Oh my god, what the hell? Uh, what? Why am I not attacking anymore? Um. Sure would be nice for my attacks to work. Okay, he's got defeated, but a blue mo well no, I actually have a ton of revives. Why do I have so many revives? Uh don't know why my weapons didn't work. Also, that was crazy. Probably would have been much easier if you know anything worked. I don't know why it stopped. No. 
I just jump over you? Was that intentional or was it an accident? No, jumping over you is not something I should do. Uh, I can try to bait you up over with it, though. This is hilarious. Okay, doppelganger down. It's probably a big fight there. Man, that's so wacky. I'm so glad I had so many pickups. All right, so many revives. I only have one, two, three. I didn't pick up awake. Maybe it doesn't count deaths here because how weird it is. Oh, hey, it's a portrait of Brawner. Whoa. Da -da -da -da. Now every little bit of damage helps. Away with the Sun Atlantean. I actually have to... Like, hey, Karasu. Oh my god, it feels weird going back to this. This is crazy. You know, it's like Ponko to pull off something nutty like this. Oh, right, I do have to max out Tronus Box if I wanted for Ashes. Well, I suppose it doesn't much matter since I don't think anything's going to be happening full way through. Hey, dual hands. Aren't really dual a handy, but whatever. Oh man, maybe there was something on the left I missed. There must have been a path up. Hey, Marble Gallery. Or wait, isn't it Alchemy Lab then it's Black Marble Gallery in inverse? Okay, there was something here. Statue though. Probably a secret. I can walk through that. That feels weird. I think it's the Armadillo either. Okay, yeah, it's the left route. Okay, so... Well, definitely not having enough time to get through there. This stage is enormous. This is like every other stage. By far. In fact, it might be larger than every other stage combined. It's that big. Also, my kill count is terrible. Like, holy crap, 16,000? This is worse than some of my hyper and hurry and stuff. Oh, no, wait, it's because it's not on hyper. That's why. Hyper really does help keep things flowing fast. Hurry, though, doesn't really do much. In fact, it makes it worse. So long without hyper, too. Need to see what unlocks that. Woo. I'm a jumping. It's a loading screen. Ah, can I jump over the statue? Nope. That's some wackiness. Okay, this is the path up, but probably don't have the time to get anything done. What would even be here? Oh, wait, no. I can check out the room on the top left there. Gotta check the map. This stage is going to be very complex. Ooh, the old statue with dudes in it. Wait, I'm getting the sunbeam on the portraits. They count as bosses? Or was there something else there? No, like, big fuzz timer showing up. Missiles, Torona's box, woohoo. Then I have to go stream some extermination and not actually too long from now. Oh yeah, it definitely looks like something, but not let me through the door. Oh, maybe I have to go fight this boss over here? Or is there something here? Man, you never know with Ponquil. Vampire survivors. That's timely. Da, da, da. Well, these definitely are something. There's no way that's not some sort of secret. Yeah, definitely. That's way too conspicuous. Hey, it's Snipers of Goth. 
Wait, no, that's not Sniper of Golf. That's a, that's Angel Sniper or something. That is not Sniper of Golf at all. How dare you to sneak by me like that? I might barely be able to get to the boss. Just if barely. Ooh, it's going to be another 2D. Right? No, it's still 3D. Weird. Come on, come on, move it, Leon. Oh, hey, the giant flea man. Yeah, this should be enough time, especially with homing miss. I should have one more chest. And you are some sort of spider face thing. Get some multi-stage missile. Okay, maybe, maybe it isn't a secret. It's a background thing. Okay, yeah, there's another pickup. Scorpion Gate allows karma coins to materialize and grants access to a new part of Dracula's castle. Probably not the room on the left, though. Probably not that one. All right, Leon has cleared it. Oh, right, it's the teleport gates. Well, I care about that right now. Let me see if I can get up here. Wait, is there even a door here? Hey, we're in the library. Whatever that means, we'll see the librarian. That'll be a wacky thing. Okay, yeah, I can just... Barely make it through here, though I won't be able to accomplish anything before. Are we getting Red Death or? Okay, I'm going to revive, see if I can. I can in no way see what color this death is. Well, I can freeze, but I don't know whether that's real death. Oh, hey. I got the discus. Fire's a defensive projectile. The armadillo. Okay, so entering this section gets me access to these. Another chest. And there's too much fiery effect on the... Ooh, and another... Is that another coffin? Well, see if I can make it, but probably not unless... Maybe if I grabbed another warlog again. Oh well. New achievement. Defeat the giant Medusa head with Leon Belmont. I unlock Trevor Belmont. New achievement. Defeat Malphus and Ode to Calcivania. Alex Hyper Ode to Calcivania. In the Stellar Gate, after defeating the giant bat, heart refresh, new teleporter. In the Scorpion Gate, after defeating the Puppet Master, Karma Coins, new teleporter. Drive six minutes with Leon Belmont. Unlock the whip. Get the curved knife to level one. Unlocks the curved knife. Alright. High achievements. Uh. Not. Get. Stats page. This is actually slightly different, isn't it? Oh, and whatever the Sparog statue is, it's a hidden weapon, it seems. Got itself up to level 8. And my most damaging weapon was the Vampire Killer at 2.5 million, but multi-stage missiles had the highest DPS. That's the first of many. The first of many Ode to Castlevanias. Another day, another Beswick checked off. Who knows how many we have to go, because who knows how many characters we have. But well, Leon Belmont is the 1,956 done. And that takes us down to 108 more to go with Leon. We got Trevor coming up next because I didn't unlock Sonia. Ode to Castlevania is coming in hot, heavy, and very, very long. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Please like, dislike, comment, subscribe. If you haven't, and thanks to anyone who has. Either way, have a good day and keep messing around in the Vampire Survivors Beswick, Ode to Castlevania style.